can see this animation is basically divided into three parts the highlighted pieces which come close to the camera and these are animated uh, one by one so this way I could put and rotate all of them at the right angle when they finished the animation and the opening of the lid was also basically the same it was also just a keyframe animation I just grouped the pieces of the lid and I could just do a basic rotation keyframing with the same explosive curves uh, this is the third part this is what I want to talk about mainly which are all the smaller things which also fly out from the box these I just wanted to keep it uh, out of focus in the background but of course I didn't want to animate it because it wouldn't make sense to animate 500 pieces uh, one by one so what I did here is I put all of the objects under the fracture object which is basically just creating a particle for each object so you can think of them as particles and animate them as particles so the animation of these small pieces can also be divided into two one of them is the motion in the z-axis and the y-axis up that's what the plane effector is doing and then there's a random effector which is assigning a random position and rotation to each of the pieces this is what's going to make it a lot more organic and uh, animated and because I didn't want all the pieces to start animating at the same time I use these linear fields which are basically touching the top objects first and then starting to affect the objects on the bottom so that the particles on the top would fly out first and that the particles on the bottom would only follow them later so one of the linear fields is assigned to the plane effector and the other linear field is assigned to the random effector this way I can also have another layer of control I can affect the random and plane effector separately this way I could achieve the exact effect that I wanted to so yeah I hope you enjoyed this form of video this short breakdown of a project I worked on I'm planning to do a few more of this in the future yeah let me know what you think and let me know what I should improve and change or anything what you would like to see 